Bart Houston with motion to the near side, gives it to Clement off the left edge. He will shuffle into the end zone, and they'll call it a touchdown. Corey Clement. Perfect day for spring football down on the field with Corey Clement, who found the end zone. Kind of weird when you know you're just getting limited reps. You're in there for one series. How do you approach a situation like that when you want to make the most of it? You got to make it feel like it's your last one. So uh, every time I come out here, whether it's a third period or, you know, getting tackled, you know, I treat a third period like I'm getting tackled. And uh, some of the defenders get mad at me, but I think I have to practice good habits. And uh, that's the only way you're going to become a better person out here. So uh, I try to teach everybody who just, you know, everybody has something to bring to the table. So I just try to learn from every aspect of the game. Had some good cuts on that play before you found the end zone. Just yeah. communication with this new line and the backs. How important it is to really get that down this time of year? Uh, it's the, I think the key is just staying patient and allowing everything to set up. And uh, I think this past year, everything had to slow down for me. I think everything was just moving at a rapid pace. So I'm not even mad that the game has slowed down for me and just take the back seat a little bit and try to become you know, a teacher to the game, also a student, and try to you know, apply it to the field. Did you get what you wanted out of this spring? Did you get everything you wanted from, from all the practices? Yeah, yeah. I, I feel as if I got better every day. And I came out here every day with a purpose. And I'm going to be competing with a lot of backs this season. And, uh, you know, I can't really think about that because we have a lot of great teams, you know, who are coming to play us, both on the road and here. So I, I think I, I got a lot of more work to do. And uh, my team is right behind me. Better situation now where you're not thinking about the injury like you were towards the tail end when you were trying to come back. Now, is it even in your mind or you move past that? I move right past it, but it's something I can't forget and uh, something to learn from. So, uh, you know, everybody who's going through, you know, adverse situation, you know, it, it, you can you can forget. I mean, you can forget, but never forget. You know, uh, I think the circumstances always, you know, rely on yourself, and you have to put yourself in a great position, you know, to come out here and just do the best you can and show the fans that you're not just a football player, but also a great guy off the field. So finally, how do you take everything you've done this spring, your approach that you've shifted a little bit here going into this next season, how do you take that into summer so you're ready come fall? I just think, I, I, like I said, you can't really forget, so I just have to build off last year. And uh, I think that's one of my biggest motivations right now. Uh, I had high expectations last season. And uh, I just got to get back to that, you know, that, that feel again. And uh, coming out here each day, you know, just work and uh, just have fun with it. I think putting too much stress on yourself, you know, causes your body mentally and physically to break down.